People will ask me about cloudy water. And when you get a hot tub, you're going to either be bringing in standard well water or standard city water, which is loaded with minerals and loaded with calcium. And so you're going to have to deal with that. Now, when it first comes in, it's in small enough particles that you can't see them. But over the next 10 days or two weeks, they'll form large enough clods or large enough balls that you'll be able to visually see it in the tank. And so all you've got to do is ignore it and the filter will catch that as soon as they get to be large enough. Or you could use a clarifier, you could use a, a stain and scale inhibitor, or you could use an iron out or a metal protect product. The metal protect products just encapsulate the iron so that it doesn't turn orange. That's all that does. When you put a clarifier in there, clarifier is a glue that glues the little dirt guys together, makes them big enough to be caught by the filter. The reason I'm not that fond of clarifiers is that it actually glues the filter together and makes it shorten its life expectancy. So I'm not a real big proponent of clarifiers. But then there is a stain and scale inhibitor, which is like a silicate, which puts it all over the inside of the tub and all the inner rotating parts of your jets and all over the, the spa so that nothing can stick to it. That allows the calcium to settle and fall to the bottom where it can be simply vacuumed out. So cloudy water can be bacterial. If your kids had a huge party over the weekend, you'd probably want to shock it with some chlorine or some shock out, which is potassium peroxymonosulfate, in order to just catch the hot tub's natural purification and natural filtration system up. You've got to catch up because that bather load over the weekend really exceeded its capacity to keep up. So cloudy water is not necessarily a bad thing. Smell it. That if it has a bad smell, that's probably bacterial. Chlorine will be the best for that. And if it doesn't have any smell, it just looks hazy, think about how old the water is. If it's fairly young, let it fix itself. If it's fairly old, think about what got in there that you need to filter out. But just making a filter change or filter cleaning may be all it takes.